moving on to your eye work. There is no rule book to follow with your eye makeup. Um, there are different techniques you can use depending on the shape of your eye. I think they call almond shaped eyes, so they're very familiar to me. A lot of people have a hooded eye or a deep set eye, wide set eyes, different techniques you can use. I love wearing at least two different eyeshadow colors. Um, you can certainly use one. There's no rule book on what colors to use for you, but you will find colors that work better for me. I have to stay away from purples because of the color of my um, under eyes. There's a whole lot of different diagrams you can follow um, just to find what works best for you. But I, I recommend something that's easy, um, that's versatile. You can dress it up, dress it down, um, and something you don't have to fuss a whole lot with. Um, that's why I love Unique Eye Products. They really stay, stay the day. They stay all day long. Um, I'm just going to take you through palette six. Um, picking a palette is great. Um, I love it because it's like an all-in-one. I can just grab that for my going on a trip. I've got eyeliner in there. I've got everything I need. Um, I like to start with a darker color for the, um, I'm going to start with the crease area. Um, this is how I do a little bit of depth with my eyes. Um, so I'm just using that with the blending brush and I'm holding the brush out um, to kind of spread it easily. So I'm going to go into, with using the deluxe brush, I'm going to use the same color. A little, lid a little bit more. I'm going to clean off my brush real quick with the... A lighter color for inside and up onto the brow bone using that color. I'm going to use a little bit of a shimmery color and just put it, blend it into the lid and the inner eye. Uh, liner shader brush and the dark brown. There we go. That makes me happy. Me too. Back to blending, always blending. Okay, I'm going to use a little bit of eyeliner because there. Concealer brush to just fix up. And the thing about the concealer brush is if it still has leftover concealer on it, it's super great for just 
just a little touch up around the lips, around the eyes. It's, it's all like pre-wired. Just a little bit of liner. For eyebrows, I love the precision brow liner. Um, very nice. Um, this is all some people need is just a little brow liner. I need a little extra myself because they're very sparse brows. But I like to start with the brow liner and just kind of do a, a brow shape. So that just gives me a light shape. Now some people, again, this is all you need for your brows. Um, you can see most women uh, lose their brow, um, like this part is a little bit lighter, so they might need to pencil just that part in, pencil, pencil some sparse areas in. Me, I need a little extra. So I head for my brow obsession palette. This is fantastic. Look at it. Look, look at all that yummy stuff. <clears throat> I use my brow artist brush and I'm going to use the lighter color first. And just create the shape. And then use the darker color to do the tile. Back to the lighter color. I'm choosing the thickness. I like a pretty natural brow. Then I'm going to use the um, the setting wax, just a light dip. and then the spoolie to soften it all. Make sure that wax is all over everybody so they all stay put. I've seen uh, recently a YouTube video on a glycerin brow. It was a little bit too much for me. I like the setting wax. It's just that little lightness. Oh, and then I'm gonna go in with um, the brow artist brush and the angled head and just finish up the uh, any little spots, creating thing. Now, you can see the difference that it makes from here to here. And this one, I actually already outlined the uh, brow, so it makes a big difference. Gives you that little bit of brow. Turin, turin. That's it. Lastly, we're going to finish up with some lashes because like icing to cake, you never want to forget your lashes. That is critical. I'm ready. Lash primer. I love this lash primer. It conditions your lashes as well as priming them for longer lengths. I put on a very, very light layer. Oop. Next, I'm going to move to my 4D lashes. All in one, I love the 4D. Very, very happy making me. I 
have different kinds of uh, mascara. We have the regular Epic, we have waterproof Epic, there is a brown Epic. For those odd ducks who like to use brown mascara, I'll never understand. But that's okay, right? That's okay. Now, some people like just one coat of mascara. I do a little bit more. Lashes are my thing. Um, if you look at all the pictures I did as a little girl when I drew pictures, I'd always have eyes with lashes. So I've always loved them. I've been wearing mascara since I was about 14. Um, to me, you can go out with just mascara on, that's totally okay. There we go. That is very pretty basic eye. Now we're not just going to line our lip like that. We're going to fill it in. Use a little bit of luscious uh, lip gloss, lucrative lip gloss. Oh, and then, so this is a basic, a basic look. Hello! I like to keep my uh, makeup routine five to maybe seven minutes. But if you got really excited, you could add things like a little bit of highlighting at this point, um, or those kind of fun tricks if you'd like. Um, but this is just a basic face, and again, I stress um, using a Behold spray. When you do that, you want to lift your eye, eyebrows, close your lashes, but don't stick your lashes down onto your face, otherwise the spray might make your uh, lashes run. That's it. That's it for the day. You can go out now. Um, so, uh, I can always help, um, help you find a palette that works best for you, um, a liner that you like. Um, Go wrong with our mascara. I I keep trying others, and there's nothing that compares to my Epic. It, there's not only the palettes, uh, which we are going to be saying goodbye to the palettes um, and just have one palette a year, um, but you can also customize your palette, um, creating your own dream palette with four colors. Very happy to help you in that too. works for you that's what I'm here for I absolutely dig making women feel their best and helping women feel their best and most confident um, and making it work for your lifestyle